this is my 12th year teaching. So I've taught at three other districts, including Whitefield, uh, one in Texas, and then two here uh, in Colorado Springs. And just the simple fact of uh, the amount of support that Whitefield gives you as a school district. And then uh, to top it off, this department, the amount of support I got within my first few years of teaching, you know, I've only been here a year and a half now. Uh, it's just been impeccable compared to the other school districts that I work at. Uh, the amount of support they've given me, the amount of positive feedback, negative feedback, things I'm doing right, things I'm doing wrong. This district does a really good job for uh, new teachers to the district and uh, being able to accommodate them to the, the ways of Whitefield. Um, I chose Whitefield because Whitefield is most like the community in which I grew up. Uh, very hardworking, middle class, down to earth. Uh, and you know, just you know, want to work hard and accomplish you know, everything they accomplish through hard work. My name is Thomas Cobb. Well, I didn't want to be a teacher, which is kind of funny. My mom was a teacher and I decided, no, not going to do it, not going to go down that road. Um, but when I started working with uh, students and when I did my student teaching at Doherty High School, um, I, I was like, I can do this and I really want to do this. I want to work with young people much easier than working with adults. My name is Julie Veroni. This is the beginning of my 13th year of teaching at Whitefield High School. So I am involved with Blake Crew, which I absolutely love because we can uh, really make sure that freshmen joining us feel that sense of family and community that I experienced joining this school. And I also work on a couple of committees like the Climate Committee and PBIS, which both of those also support a positive uh, working environment for everybody, which I love being a part of. Okay, what I love about this department is that I do feel like it's an extension of my family. I can go to anyone in the department and talk to them. I can um, ask them for uh, any kind of support and I feel like they challenge me and allow me to grow and become a better teacher. My name is Tiffany Shims, my 18th year teaching all at Whitefield High School. I chose to teach at Whitefield because my advisor told me to go apply right now. She called me and got me out of bed and said, go apply, they're waiting for you. Uh, but I really am thrilled that I ended up at Whitefield because it's a great fit for me and I love the community and the kids. And I work with the FCCLA group, which is a, a student leadership organization through Family and Consumer Sciences, and I do the Teacher Cadet Program. Oh, probably my college advisor who's retired, and she travels and she works out all the time, and I want to be like her when I grow up. Well, that's why I get up in the morning, come see your smiling face. Serena Patterson, this is my third Betsy Vasquez, my 19th year. You know, I, I honestly hope that we have a good impact. I, you know, I had a favorite teacher from high school that I still remember, and I just hope that by the three of us being, you know, who we are, that maybe someday they'll go, oh yeah, I remember that lunch lady. She was pretty cool, or something like that. You know, smiles, uh, feeding working, the kids, working with the kids. A lot of restrictions food-wise, less salt, less sugar, more whole grain, uh, lots of fruits and vegetables, and we do try to get you as much uh, fruit, fresh fruit and vegetables as we can on the, on the menu. So that's, yeah, a lot, of, a lot of changes, dietary changes. My name is Mr. Minos. This is year 31. I'm the uh, varsity basketball coach here at Whitefield, and I really enjoy that. And hopefully we'll have a, a, a really solid season, a very special season. Uh, and on several committees here at school. Uh, our department's outstanding. Uh, I think we do a great job in classrooms and doing what's best for kids. And what I really like about our, our department is uh, what we do outside the classroom with extracurricular activities and coaching. And I think we have a, a special bond with kids. All I can hope is that I make a positive impact in some way in, in each of them. My name is Amanda D'Amato. I grew up in the community. So I really wanted to come back and teach here. I love the school. Um, and I've always had a lot of pride in Widefield, and I really love the fact that I get to teach with some of the people that were my teachers too. I have been teaching for 10 years. I teach chemistry, biology, and then I teach the Project Lead the Way biomedical science classes, so right now I teach human body systems and medical interventions. When I was a kid, I wanted to either be a pediatrician or a neonatologist. Everybody is so close here, and the science department, we truly are a family. 
and we all care about each other very much. I just hope that I can ignite a little bit of passion in them about science. I have had kids come back and tell me that, you know, I've made a difference in their lives. My name is Angie Murphy. I just, I really love the community here. I love the cohesiveness of Whitefield. I like the spirit that we have. I love the people. I love the diversity. I really love everything about it. This is my 19th year teaching, my 11th year at Whitefield. I'm a graduate of Whitefield High School. I graduated here in 1989. I teach honors biology, AP biology, and regular biology. I do link crew. I got involved with that probably my second year here at Whitefield, and I really love to watch our juniors and seniors mentor the freshmen, and I teach freshmen, and it's really a powerful thing to see your young people then be leaders for our, our freshmen that need it really desperately as they're coming into Whitefield, and to include them into the family of Whitefield. I pattern my life after Jesus. He's my idol. I'd love to be like him, and so I try really hard to be loving, accepting of others, and pattern my life after that. Uh, when I was a kid, I wanted to be a pediatrician, but once college hit and deciding I wanted to be a mom too, and looking at how many years that would take, I was like, mm, I don't think so, but I still want to do something with kids, and so then I went into teaching instead. When something happens, whether it be a tragedy or something really awesome, we all rally around each other. Uh, we all know each other. For some of our kids who are, you know, in the school, they can't get away with anything, which I love. Our science department isn't just a school department. We're family. We treat each other like family. We're always there for each other. We have each other's backs, and we help and support each other through hard times and good times. I don't know. We're just, we're there to celebrate all the good things, and we're there to give each other a hug if we need it on that day. And I love our department because we love kids and we always want to do what's best for kids. That's what we always kind of come down to. We have kids come back and say, you know, I really love the relationships that you built with me. And I have a lot of relationships with kids still. I keep up with them on Facebook or they're texting. I just had a student the other day that um, texted me and said, I want you to know how much you know you meant to me and I'm in med school right now and I just need your support. I'm having a hard time and I want to quit, but I, I'm not going to. And, and I just was able to give him a really encouraging text back. And I just love that. I love the, that those relationships are continuing even after they're out of school. But I think the biggest thing is that my students impact me. So the impact that they have on me is more than I can say that I've had on them. I love science and I love working with people. Kids are my favorite. It was an easy fit to get to have a job where I could work with kids all day long. And My name is Catherine Ford. I teach biology and honors human physiology here in the Whitefield High School Science Department. This is my third year teaching. When I was a kid, I wanted to be a doctor. I wanted to be a heart surgeon, and then in high school, I wanted to be a physician's assistant. And then by the time I graduated college, I realized it was not where I wanted to be. I did not want the fast-paced, high-stress medical field for my life. I do stuff outside of the community here at Whitefield. I uh, tutor science, anything else that is needed at Urban Peak which is a homeless youth shelter. I do that um, every Thursday. And then um, I am a big sister through Big Brothers Big Sisters of Colorado. So I have a 10-year-old little sister and we hang out. My heroes would be uh, George Mueller. He made um, orphanages, thousands and thousands of, of children. So he's definitely one of my uh, heroes. As a new teacher, it was really wonderful to come into having so much support and so much guidance from fellow teachers, admin, and other staff. So I have felt um, just a very fostering and loving environment here. I think everyone takes care of everyone. I think everyone treats everyone well. And so it's been a safe place to be. But they have changed my life. My life has been full from all the relationships that I get with them. They are incredibly kind-hearted. I haven't met a single person at this school who I've had poor conversations or poor relations with. Um, everyone at the science department is super welcoming. It's just, it's family. If you're going to do something, you might as well have fun doing it. Whitefield is a crazy, fun, fascinating place. It, it's a community where there's just a bunch of people that are there for everyone else about all the time. And it's a bunch of people who may not have everything, but when we come together, we feel like we have everything. That's really cool, and I haven't really experienced that anywhere else in my life. My name is Jason Nell, and I teach geology, physics, and AP physics. My idol would be my dad. Uh, he is one of the most persevering men I know, and uh, I try to take that to heart with what I do here in life. The science department is really special just because uh, I had to move away from my home before, and when I came to Whitefield, it became my home away from we have some great teachers that do some great teaching, but they also are great people. I try to just show students that it's okay to just have fun and be goofy and to be yourself.
yourself. And you can do that respectfully in a constructive manner. And you can have fun with just about anything that you do. I hope that in some way that that's the impact that I can have.